Hello, what's up everyone? So, mobile VR station is broken for like the fifth time, but I found like a third, another way to fix it. So, watch all of my previous videos on mobile VR station if you haven't yet. Um, those will show you multiple other fixes for different issues that mobile VR station has. Um, but this one. I completely forgot to download a Bone Lab mod to show you. I already fixed it for Blade and Sorcery. Now I'll show you how to fix it. Um, it and you can repeat the same steps for any mod or any game. But anyway, so we're going to download a Bone Lab mod, just a small one. Uh, let's see. Like this one. Any. And this will work with almost any mod, except for ones that specifically have different requirements. But you download your mod, you wait three years for it to download, because I feel like I may or may not have downloaded a way bigger mod than I intended to. 400 megabytes is a lot. But it's downloading pretty fast. <coughs> oh yeah, if you couldn't tell, I'm extremely sick. Anyway, hang on. This has taken forever. I'll show you while it's downloading how to fix things. So you open Mobile VR Station. Let's say you just downloaded it. First thing you're going to do, Android fixes. You enable that. So you press this. You'll have your settings menu come up. And then you'll just turn on allow access to manage all files. Then you'll close your Oculus menu. Press that. Then you'll verify. And boom, you'll get that. But, it'll still probably not work. And the reason that is, you go into local files, and you go into downloads, say you wanna, um, you wanna install this mod, right? Game missing, click here, obviously. Bone Lab mods, or any other, and Bone Lab, Blade and Sorcery, and Pavlov are pretty much the only games I know you can mod, and Pavlov you can only get new maps for it, but either way, Pad Pavlov just added um, modding support in integrated into the game, so you don't need to mess with that. Um, you don't need to mess with saves right now, um, because you really can't do much other than a specific Bone Lab mod for saves. But Blade and Sorcery Nomad mods I already fixed, Bone Lab mods I have not. So you'll press that, and likely, and let's see if it works or not, because I... It did something very specific for Blade and Sorcery. If it works, then I'll just show you how to do it anyway. Failure. You need to authorize that. It You set, and you, it'll say that you allowed access to all files, but you technically didn't. What you need to do is, um, so what you need to do is, I believe it is, go to modding information, bone lab mods, view mod folder, did you authorize, da 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 da, scope. Scoped storage at scoped storage action a actions. I I am dyslexic. Um, sc scoped storage actions. So request access. And no, you're not g just gonna press this. You want to go into Android data. And it's not my cursor thing isn't showing up, so I have to like aim it. But you want to highlight data, Android data. Press use this folder. Allow. Then, you do it again. But, instead of going through all that, you just press use this folder. Alright, now that you've allowed access to those two, you should be able to go back into downloads, press the mod you just downloaded, press install mod, game missing, bone lab mods, and it should work. Hopefully. And if I did anything wrong, I'll see if I can correct it, and I'll probably have to film a new video on it. But otherwise, this should this should work because it worked for Blade and Sorcery earlier. Boom, it worked. So just do the exact steps in the exact order that I did them in, and you should be able to download mods now. And now I have a new mod for Bone Lab. Um, and you can also install the uh, script for Bone Lab that allows you to download any mod from within the game, but that's a lot more complicated, and I'm genuinely way too lazy to make a video on it. Although, if this video gets... Let's say, if this video gets 100 likes, I'll do a video on how to do that with Bone Lab, because I have access to a computer now. But otherwise, I will see you guys in the next one, which will probably be a Ghost of Tsushima video, since I'm gonna have my editor work on that.
because uh, it's 50 minutes of, um, of gameplay that I'm going to need to shorten down quite a lot. But otherwise, I will see you guys in the next one. Thank you for your time, and goodbye.